Marlin? Oh, shit. Stay back. The best time of your life, don't you? You want me to come and hit it right, don't you? Well, what's good, Ripper Gang, and welcome back to another video with your boy, Soul Ripper. Today, we will be doing part two of episode one of The Walking Dead, the final chapter. So if you guys missed the first video, make sure you go back and check that out. It was really good. I'm talking about a real good story beginning. So if you guys are new to the channel, be sure to leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. And to all my day one Ripper Gang members, you already know what it is. Ripper Gang is in the building. Hit that like, share, and subscribe button. Make sure your notification bell is turned on. That's the way every time I drop a video, you will be notified. So without further ado, Ripper Gang, let's get straight into this video. Alright, so remember when we left off, we had to find AJ, well, we had to help AJ make friends. They're pretty good. So hopefully, with the monsters. he'll actually make friends Come on, this time. Food's <sighs> AJ! Oh, shit. I'm so sorry about that. It, it happens sometimes. <laughs> He's a jumpy little guy. You gonna be okay? He can't go around punching people in the. You know, I expect him to eat at the same table. <laughs> I'll talk to him. Yeah, he'll be all right, man. Hey. Hey. He'll get it. What are you looking at? What's that bird doing? That's gross. He should stop. That bird's a crow. <coughs> In school, they told us they're called scavengers. Can you say that? Scavengers. No. Scavengers. Scavengers. What's it mean? It means they don't hunt like us. They just eat stuff that's already dead. Huh. Scavengers are gross. Oh, yeah. I didn't mean to hit him. I didn't know that it was Marvin. Marlin. Right. AJ, I'm sure they'll forgive you. But we should go talk to them. But... But I don't think they like me. I can just tell. They don't know you, AJ. I'll bet when they do, they'll like you just as much as I do. I don't know. Marlon was really mad. And that girl I bit, she yelled at me. You bit her. They're really I mean, scary. I would've yelled at you too. AJ, you bite me, listen, dude. I'm just saying. We haven't eaten for days. The car is gone. All that's outside these walls are walkers. Do you yeah, really want right. to go back she's out there? The truth. No. So we should apologize to Marlin. Right now? Well, we can work up to it. Let's talk to the other kids first. All right, help AJ make friends. All right, we're going to start over here. Hey. Hey, you're new. I am. I'm carving a weapon. Uh, yeah, I can see that. You're good at that. You like that, huh, little dude? You wanna see something cool? I wanna see. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty rad, huh? That's how you fuck up some monsters. Swear. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Huh. <laughs> Let's go over here. Well, we know this dude, but let's talk yes. to this dude. Red hey, guys. Clem, AJ, this is Omar. Yeah, Omar, that's his name. All right, Chef what's up, Omar? Omar? Hello, and no, it's not ready yet. Omar's a perfectionist. The slightest flavor out of place, and he's grumpy for a week. You can eat, or you can eat right. All it'll cost you is a little patience. 
I'll let you guys know when we're done. So he's serious chef. Oh, Chef Boyo Omar. Check him out. You can eat, or you can eat right. All right then, my guy. Hello. Hello. Oh, hey. It's you two. Clementine, right? Yep. A sim, right? What are you writing? What happened today? I chronicle everything. Hmm, like a diary? I try to think of it more like a history book. Those who do not learn from the past and all that. <sighs> you seemed really mad at Marlin back there. He keeps pulling back the safe zone. We have fewer and fewer places to hunt, which means we're gonna have fewer and fewer things to eat. The new girl went and helped the hun hunting party come back. Reading a little dude's See. journal. Hey, zip it. That is not yours to read, kid. Put <coughs> it back. It was just sitting there. So? AJ, give it back to him. Okay. Thank you. This thing is the only place I get any real privacy around here. I gotta preserve what I can, you know? I gotta finish this before dinner. Not to be, like, rude, but, you know. Bye. See you later. Alright. We ain't gonna go to them yet. Let's go to the girl that you bit, AJ. There's that girl I bit. Yeah. Wanna talk to her? Yeah. You mean say I'm sorry? Yeah, pretty much. Yes. Say you're sorry, dude. She's scary and always seems so mad. You can do it. You just gotta... Tell her why you did it. Because of my... thing? Yep. It's nothing to be ashamed of. Just be honest. Yes? I'm sorry I bit you sometimes. When I get scared, I do that, but I don't mean to. I just... I just get scared, and I'm sorry, and I hope your finger is okay. Oh, Shug, it's all right. We can all get a little crazy when we get scared. Hey, Thank you for that, your honesty that, and that. your apology. I did it! She you sure did. Apology. Good job, dude. Tennessee, I think that was Hey guys. What is this? Our graveyard. You guys still do that? Kinda, sorta. So, who's buried here? Nobody really. This is where we buried ten sisters' belongings. Minnie and Sophie. Twins. Lost them. Both about a year ago. Paying respects. Should we do that too? Maybe? Yeah, I think that'd be a very nice thing to do, AJ. Come on. Where do they keep putting... That's just like when I seen her put that thing in her pocket, I think, on the first episode. Like, well, on part one. Thank you. What the hell is she put it in? Where, where is it going? Am I tripping, son? Clem? Yeah? I'm ready. To talk to Marlon. Okay. Right. Let's go talk to him. How you doing, my guy? How you doing? Clementine, right? I'm Brody. He's a sweet little fella. Figured there ain't a lot of room for sweetness still out there. Yeah, he is pretty sweet. Not everybody sees that. I won't pay them no mind if you won't. Apologize, little dude. I'm really sorry I hit you. Can we please stay here and eat dinner and not go out into the forest and get killed by monsters? Well, don't sweat it, buddy. You can make it up to me by teaching me your technique. 
You, a regular heavyweight. Hey, Clem! AJ! Stew's done! Oh, it's time to eat now. You guys earn your supper after all. And again, I want to let you guys know, if you see me looking this way and this way, it's because I have a screen this way and a screen this way and a camera this way and a camera this way. So, just thought I'd let you guys know that. Ladies and gentlemen, dinner is served. <sighs> Thanks. Wow, I can't remember the last time we had a hot meal. Hmm, this is really good. Damn. <sighs> On. <coughs> Don't you do it. Where are your manners, AJ? Good night. Good night. Clem. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sure they shared as much as they could. AJ, heads up. I'm full, kiddo. You can have the rest. You sure? You bet. <sighs> I'm all done. Damn. Bro, mm -hmm. who is, who is this kid? Now what? I'll tell you what. Time for something very Damn, important. Damn, that was quick. He finished oh, that God. food quick. Good night. Real quick. Violet, it's time. What's the game tonight, Lou? War. The oldest game around. A game played by man and beast alike. The only game there is. I don't know the game. The only card game I've played had less people. Don't worry. You'll pick it up as we go. It's easy. Everyone gets a stack of cards. Everyone flips one over. Highest card wins. And the winner gets to ask Clem a question. What? I want to get to know you. We all do. And what if I win? Then you get to ask us one. It's only fair. Oh, wait, what about AJ? What about him? <laughs> Looks like he's made a friend. Come on. You can take your eyes off him for one card game. All right, don't get in trouble. Both could use a break dude. from each other. Yeah, maybe. This is his first time around anyone his own age. Sometimes he acts more like an adult than a kid. It's nice to see him act like a little boy again. Lewis, if you would. Way to go, me. So, about AJ. Where are AJ's parents? You two don't really look related, so... They're dead. They were nice people. <coughs> For the most part. It makes sense. He's a nice kid. For the most part. Hey, I win! Hey, you do. So, what do you want to know? Okay, uh, what's the grossest thing you've ever eaten? It's pretty easy, uh, horse eyeballs. Slugs. Cantaloupe. Come on. Dude, I fucking uh, hate cantaloupe. It's a cantaloupe. I ate a cantaloupe is pretty once. nasty, though. I don't, I don't like that shit, neither. I'm kidding. Are you? Booyah! Come on, spit it out. So, uh, ever, uh, ever have a boyfriend? Oh my god. What? It happens. Perfectly valid question. He's you a can ask me dog, if I've dude. ever had a girlfriend. Never. Not even once? Never. Ah, <laughs> I win. So, Clem. You can't have been alone this entire time. Who used to take care of you? Family? Anyone? The first person who taught me about survival was Lee. 
What'd he teach you? Lots of stuff. Most important thing? How to shoot a gun. Useful stuff. Yeah, I taught AJ the same way, too. You gotta be honest, gotta I be win honest. again. You do indeed. Ask away. All right. Worst injury you ever saw. I uh, saw a walker get hit in the head so hard both his eyeballs flew out. Pretty cool. I saw Damn. someone have their intestines pulled all the way out. Like, all the way. It goes on for a while. We got a lot of guts. I saw this guy get his face beaten in with a crowbar. Badly. Hey, I remember that. Any skin left. I do remember that. Ouch. If you guys ever played mm, this, he hey, it. leave in the comments if you remember that scene. I do remember that. Victory Violet. Here's something I love to ask when I'm in groups. <clears throat> Out of the four of us, who do you think is gonna die first? That is fucked up. Hmm. <laughs> oh, I know. Chickening out, huh? Hmm. Shame. Oh well. I am the greatest card player of all time. People Just ask your damn question. Ever? Actually, never mind. What? Ask it. It's not a fun question. Ask. Ever had to kill someone you loved? <coughs> Lewis. Hey, she wanted me to ask. Lee. His name was Lee. It was the same day I found out my parents were dead. That sounds like a rough day. Yeah, worst day of my life. I think I'm done playing for tonight. Yeah, it's probably for the best. You wanted me to ask. Let's go, AJ. Time for bed, little guy. Let's roll. Uh, good night. Night, AJ. Long day, huh? Yep, real long. Uh, I hope you know Lewis didn't mean any harm there. He's just the world's biggest dumbass. Yeah, he's my best friend, so I can legally call him that. You guys relax, get some sleep. Feel human for a night. Yeah, Good morning, hopefully. come find me. We can talk about making this long term. We can stay? We can talk about it. I don't get too happy, little guy. He said we can talk about it. That's not a guarantee. We can talk about it. All right, well. Oh. All right. That looks like a really safe window. It does. You got good. bars on the windows, two by four. Shit, y'all good. Y'all good in there. This box has so many colors. Well, must have been an artist living in here. What's an artist? It's like a person who colors a lot, draws, does pictures. You mean like tin? Yeah, like 10. Huh. I like to do pictures too. Oh, shit. I, I didn't know Marlon set you up in this room. I just wanted to grab something from the closet. Where the hell is it? Oh. What? That's what I was looking for. It belonged to Sophie. Uh. Ten sister. He was asking for more art supplies and stuff, so I was going to. Oh, sorry. We didn't know. No, no. It's it's fine. Don't don't worry about it. Honestly, it's just been sitting here for the past year and no one's touched it. If AJ wants to play with it, it's it's fine. 
You should probably give the box back. It doesn't belong to us. Thanks, buddy. It's just that Ten wanted it since it was his sister's and all. It's okay. You can finish your drawing, though. I don't mind. Huh. I see you're, um, settling in. Yeah, I wouldn't call that yeah, settling, my guy. Yeah, okay? Well, my girl? Sure. I guess. I always liked this room. Sophie had, like, paintings and shit on the walls. Lots of color. And Minerva. She was really musical. Not like Lewis, though. She had actual talent. <laughs> she had the most amazing voice. Real bluesy. Marlon always joked that he would scavenge a guitar and the two of them would tour the country. That was a long time ago. After they... Afterwards, Brody and Ten took down all the paintings and that was the end of it. I shouldn't have even brought it up. It's not a good memory. Guess I just lost my train of thought. Do you mind us being here? In their room? No. Ah, it's... it's okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad, actually. I'm glad it's getting some use instead of just sitting around picking up dust. What exactly happened to them? Sophie and Minerva. They went scavenging with Marlon and Brody out past the safe zone. Didn't make it back. It happens. Yeah, that's a little sketch. Honestly, I just miss having someone that's around to talk sketch. to. There's just so many dudes. It. This place can get a little too bro town for my liking sometimes. And I'm not exactly like a people person. You know, I know I sometimes have a habit, have a habit of being a little bit too harsh. You come off all right. I thought you were pretty cool. Oh, um, thanks, I guess. You were pretty cool, too, up there against those walkers. Hey, Clem, I'm an artist now. Okay. <laughs> Let's go see the drawing. Not bad, kiddo. What you got? What you got? I should be getting back. Thanks again for the box. You're pretty cool, AJ. See ya. Yeah, see ya. Yeah, it's something strange, man. Especially okay, the Alvin Jr. About Time the for bed. Okay, here. For me? For the wall. To make our home look nice. That's a good idea, AJ. How about here? Uh, AJ? Oh, shit, why are you under the bed? Hey there, what are you doing? This is where I'm gonna sleep. <laughs> what? No, it's not. It's safe under here. No one can get me. Come on, AJ. The bed is way better. Oh, man. This bed is so comfy. What about the door? What if someone comes in? What if they try to hurt us? What if they steal our stuff? I'll keep watch. I'll sleep with one eye open if I have to. You can't sleep like that. I tried. If I stay here, no one can find me, and I can keep guard and watch over you. I can protect us. <sighs> hey, boy, get what's in the into bed you? and go to sleep, boy. We tired, boy. We tired. Please, Clem. It's not so bad down here. AJ, listen to me. It's gonna be okay. Please just give the bed a chance. It's soft and warm. I think you'll really like it. This bed is really soft. Yeah. Told you See, so. We told you. It's really, really soft. Good night, AJ.
Clem? Hmm? This place is nice. I'm glad we found it. Me too. Well, looks like they're trying to settle in, but I won't say we're settled in quite yet. We ain't settled in that much. But hey, we here. We here now. He's gonna let us stay, right? I guess we're gonna find out. Let's find his office. I know where it is. I'll show you. Up here. Come on, Clem, this way. Hey, AJ, wait up. It's in here. Hey, Clem. Thanks for the pencils. I missed having colors. Sure thing. Who are these guys? They're firefighters. That one's a policeman. She's gonna save the day. But what are they? They... These were the people who protected us. Where are they? I've never seen one before. They're still out there. Someday, maybe you'll meet one. That would be cool. Yeah, Super man. Super cool. We gotta get a little dude hope, man. No, give it to me and... No, he's mine now. Hey, hey give it no, back. You give him no, back toy, bro. you don't even know what they are. Okay, okay. That's enough, you two. It's not yours anymore. It's mine. No, no it's, it's not. not. That ain't yours, oh, my guy. Fine. Thanks. You tripping. My little homie tripping. Do you know where Marlin is? I don't know. He should be around. I can go find him. That'd be nice. Thanks, Ten. Look. Hey, what'd you find? It's a picture of Marlon and Lewis. They're so little. Wow, they've known each other a long time, huh? <sighs> Marlon? Oh, shit. Stay back. Whoa, what the hell's going on? Hey, 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 it's okay, bro. Your dog tried to kill us, my guy. You said dogs brought it? back bad memories. I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were so scared of him. But I swear, Rosie's not as frightening as she seems. <laughs> Sit, girl. See? She's harmless. She just needs to get to know you is all. Here. I'll show you. Do you trust me? Oh, uh, hell no. Rosie, shh. <laughs> Okay, I guess. Man. Get down on her level. Let her get your scent. It's okay. She's not gonna hurt you. There you go. Now whistle and tell her to lie down. So lie down, Rosie. That's so cool. That's a cool. big ass doll. See? so hard. Yeah, that was pretty cool. And now Rosie will recognize you. She's really well trained. She was the headmaster's dog back when this place was still functional. But when the world went to shit, he bailed. All the other adults did. Left us behind to fend for ourselves. Wow, what a dick. <laughs> Understatement of the century. Now it's just us kids left, and I'd like it if you and AJ were a part of that. 
both of you are plenty capable, and we need that. Here. This is the current state of our plan for gathering food. We are starting to run short. It's getting harder and harder to feed everyone in this school. Okay. I didn't realize how much forest surrounds this place. It's how we've kept ourselves from unwanted attention for so long. Well, for the most part, anyway. That's the only road that leads in and out of Ericsson. If you go off it, you'll eventually end up in the valley. We used to have signs that led people to the school, but I took them down. I wanted this place to be hard to find. Okay, oh shit. What's out here? Oh, that's where we fish. Uh, got a shack for storage right here, right along the river. It's secure, mostly. Get the occasional walker or two come by. Vi and Brody should be heading out there in a bit. Okay. Dorm. The greenhouse. Oh, yeah. Well, don't get too excited about that one. We used to maintain it real well. Had plenty of vegetables growing. But it became overgrown. Upkeep was impossible. Yeah, we, uh, we keep away from that now. What's the trap area? A hunting grounds, more or less. Lewis built some traps out there to catch game. He and a Sam are set to go check them today. Yeah, that must have been the place where we was getting rid of all those zombies when we had to go out there before the big outbreak. That's the train station. There was a whole stash of food under the floorboards. Oh, where you crashed your car? Pretty sure that place is a lost cause. There's a hell of a lot of smoke coming from it when we found you two. Walkers flooded in there after all the noise you made. One more thing. You see these red lines? Yeah. So everything inside is the safe zone. It's been getting smaller over the years and the food's become more scarce. So why not go outside it? <laughs> we can't. Whenever someone goes outside the safe zone, bad shit happens. People die or disappear. I just... <clears throat> could really use the help, Clementine. Taking care of these kids, it's not easy. I'm worried that if I don't figure something out, if, if I don't fix our food situation, I can't lose anyone else. Yeah, that's so all cool and all you let Friends. me say. I'll try to help you, but what the hell am I supposed to do? I can't let another kid die. I get it. I know how it feels to lose a friend. Yeah. Well, multiply that by 30 and you'll know how I feel. <gasps> what? Ha. Huh. I was gonna say, who you getting buck with, my guy? Didn't mean to come off like a dick. Everyone's counting on me to step up. Be the leader they need me to be. I really want to be that for them. You and AJ are two yeah. more mouths to feed. Maybe you can help me feed the rest. So what do you need from us? Lewis and Asim are heading to the hunting grounds, looking for rabbits. Well. Okay. Same will, anyway. Lewis, I uh, just hope he shows up, if I'm really being honest. Violet and Brody are going up river to do some spear fishing. And hopefully, those two get along long enough to get some work done. Both teams could use some extra hands. Fish with Violet and Brody. We're gonna go fishing. Okay. Take this. I don't want you getting lost. Thanks. We need all hands on deck if we're gonna find any more food. Just remember to stay in the safe zone. We need you to come back home in one piece. So that means we can stay? What? Do you think I was gonna throw you out? Maybe. Well, as long as we got enough to eat, you're both welcome here. Go get him, AJ. All right, let's get going. See you around.
Well, looks like we're going fishing and getting more food for the flock. But, who knows? Something might come up, something may not. Hopefully it don't though, man. I don't, I'm, I'm tired of surprises. You know, I've been thinking. I wish we could all go on a road trip together. Road trip? Why bother? It's not like there's anything worth seeing anymore. Oh, come on. I'm sure there's plenty of stuff to see. Maybe Clem could show us around. You're able to get a car working, and you know how to drive? Barely. Come on, Vi. I've never driven in my life, but I'd love to learn. Yeah, I don't know. I think I'd rather stay off the road. Aw, oh, come on. There's so much to see. Yeah. Like dead people, dead people, and more dead people. Oh, ha ha. Oh. You really know how to lift someone's spirits, Vi. Just pointing out the truth. Are we going to the car? No, bud. It's broken. Good. I'm sick of the car. Yeah, you'll need it if them walkers get to flock in and surrounding everybody. I wish it's the this old way you're probably gonna get out there working. quick. We could just but you jump can in get and start through driving. a lot of more places on take feet, turns, so I understand back. that. It'd be like driving one of those cars with the top that goes down. We'd run out of gas eventually. But still, it's fun to imagine, isn't it? Where would you go, Clem? If you could drive anywhere you wanted, if gas wasn't an issue. Or a busted carburetor, or flat tires, or the transmission. Buzzkill. I'd drive down to the coastline, maybe park on the beach and go swimming. That'd be an absolute dream. You could spend every day in the sun. And die of skin cancer. Fun. We're all gonna die. I'll take skin cancer over turn it into a walker any day. I've lived here my entire life. Heck, I'd say I know every inch of these woods. I'd kind of like to unknow it. No use dreaming of what could be. We've got shit to do. Yeah, hey, Violet, I guess we should get axe. to work on those ready fish. For that axe. We got spears inside the shack. Come on. You go ahead. I'll stay out here. Where are those spears? Hey, about Bai. I'm sorry she's being a little mean. It's my fault. What do you mean? I was there when those walkers killed Sophie and Minnie. They were really close with Bai, and I think she blames me for what happened to them. I mean, how do you even apologize for something that fucked up? I don't know. You should Maybe talk I deserve to her. it. You should talk to her. I didn't about even it. notice that I'm I was sure right in the middle listen. of my subtitles. Yeah, right. Let me. I tried. I let have. Me move my it suit. just never seems like the right time. We all Aye. used to be friends. There we go. Guess I just kind of missed that. But when you showed up, I, I don't know. I just haven't seen her warm up to someone in a long time. Hmm. Do you? I mean, I hate to ask this of you, but do you think you could talk to her? See how she feels? About me? I can try, but I can't make any promises that it'll help. Thanks, Clementine. I'm gonna go check our fish traps downstream. Hey, what the hell is taking you two so long? See? I'll take this to Vi. There should be some extras lying around. Yeah, let's hope we find it, right? Alright, so let's snoop around. Let's talk to AJ. Hey you, what you looking at? V plus M. Violet and Minerva. What does that mean? Uh, it means they were really good friends. Like me and you are really good friends? Not exactly. Alright, there it is. Cool. Ready to get some fish? Yeah. Okay, let's go. 
Oh, there he is, there he is, there he is. Get him. If you got to oh, shit. You gotta be real patient Can with I it. Can I join you? Sure. Real patient with it. Hey, check out these guys over here. They're swimming against the current. Guess I don't realize it makes them easier targets. I wanna try. Take a spear. Go nuts. Go ahead and try. They're not running. Alright, let me try to get this fish. Oh, luck? Got I it. got something. Good enough for me. You got a fish. What you mean? You got something. We got a fish. Hey, um, sorry if I was weird last night about the whole room thing. Seeing someone else in there, uh, it was harder than I expected. You'd think I'd be less sentimental by now. <laughs> I'm sorry. We weren't trying to upset you. No, no, it's okay. Seriously, it's kind of nice having someone in there again. See if I can get another. Let's see if I can get another. Ooh. Hold on, hold on. <coughs> oh man, come on, bro. I, I had that the whole fish, man. Oh uh, yeah, okay. <sighs> God. Sometimes she just gets on my last nerve. You know? Yeah, I can tell. I mean, it's, it's not like I hate her. I just... <clears throat> I wish we could all go on a road trip together. God, she's so... Oh, she definitely thinks you hate her. Oh, shit. Really? Look at it. Keep slipping out. It keeps slipping out. It wasn't, nothing. it wasn't nothing there. I knew that too. I don't even know why I hit the button. Looks like they wisened up. Maybe Brody had better luck with the traps. I got one! Clem, I got one! Hey, that's what's up. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I don't know what the problem is between us. With Brody. I don't know why it's like this. Why is it so weird? I can never relax around her. It just keeps getting worse. I guess it's I weird I was trying to say too. something. It ain't weird with me, Violet. I was trying to speak to you. I, I, we I, should get going. I, I was trying to answer you. guys you. catch any fish? We caught some, but not a lot. I didn't get anything. We should catch up with Lewis and Asim. See if they had any better luck. Yeah, yeah, Mom, yeah. Are you gonna lead the way? Oh, uh, yeah. Follow me. It's not too far from here. Okay. She is mean to her, though, bro. She's pretty mean. Where are those guys? Clem, look. Someone cut it. Is that normal? Someone sabotaged this. This isn't good. A Sam? Lewis! <sighs> Let's spread out. Maybe that'll help us find them. Watch out for monsters. Hmm. Empty. Huh. Is this a Bible page? Clem, found something. Where is he going? 
Oh shit. Monster. Nice. Guys, over here. Well, we didn't kill this one. We wouldn't have left it hanging in our trap. What the hell? Found this too. Do any of the kids smoke? Nope. Nothing to smoke. Who is this unlucky fella? Where have you been? Checking nearby traps. The ones that were sprung were all empty. All the rest are broken. Someone robbed us? Oh, great. And now we're gonna starve. Fuck. That's... Fuck. Fuck. It's just... Fuck. It's okay. It's... Breathe, Brody. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. You're gonna be fine. It's just a panic attack. Take a second. Breathe in deep. And hold it. Just shut the fuck up, okay? Damn, Excuse me? Really? Are we trying to help you? I, I have to tell Marlon about this. Um, we still need food. You know, to live. We definitely don't have enough here. You guys figure it out. Damn. I'll take this hall back to school. Maybe we can ration out something. So what do we do? Eat rocks? You can't eat rocks. I'm aware. Will Marlin kick us out if we don't find food? Well, let's not find out. Where else could we look? <sighs> Let me think. Alright. The train station. It's not too far from here. Maybe, but, but it's outside, outside the safe the zone. Yeah, yeah, there was, was food in there when AJ and I passed through. Zone. It's worth a look. You sure there was food? Positive. Yeah, some of it was destroyed in the explosion, but there has to be something left. There was so much there. Or we could starve. Fine. Let's go. Well, I guess they're on their way to the train station to see if they can gather some food so Marlin don't be mad or angry. And looky, looky, there are zombies. Y'all better hope we don't get there, killed out that's here. That's where the food is. A lot more walkers than last time, though. That's great. We're gonna die. It's either die here or die from hunger. Take your pick. Clem? Maybe you should scope things out. You know the place better. Let me get a closer look. Can't be too careful. Look at the body. Look at Edna the bell. Might be able to get the walkers' attention. They do like to follow sound. We barely got out of here. It was close. It sounds scary. There's a reason. Okay. Examine the train. Could climb up there, but I don't know how that would get us inside. You look like you've got an idea. The noise from that bell could draw a lot of walkers. If one of us climbs up there and starts ringing it, Lewis, I vote Lewis. Uh, hold on. I'd like to make an alternate suggestion. Come on, Lou. You're loud, dramatic, a little annoying. You're basically a walking distraction. Just get up there. The quicker we get this over with, the better. Decisive. I like that in a woman. Just stop. Stop. This dude is a I'll horn dog, bro. I swear. Give me some cover. Fine. I'll do it. But if I die, I'm making sure Walker Lewis eats both of you first. I'll distract them until I see you guys reach safe cover. Then. I'll try to redirect the smelly patrol to give you guys a chance to sprint inside the building. When we get into position, I'll signal you. Then you can do your thing. Good luck! Alright. I guess here goes nothing. Hey, ugly! No, not Boys you. Not you either. Tim! Fine, make this confusing right now. Of course you want to come to it. Hey, look! Got your nose! Got your nose! Oh! I'm the 
in there too. Yes, these will be perfect. Clint, look. Try it out. See if it works. We ain't got time to see if that works. Let's go. Oh my goodness. Gonna need your help on this one, kiddo. You still got your gun? Just in case. Just in case. <clears throat> oh, shit. Good job, AJ. Is there more? Keep it coming. Oh, shit. trying to rack up. They trying to rack up. Stand. Slowly. Don't yell. Don't try anything. I won't hurt you. I don't have to. Who are you? The name's Abel. And I'm hungry as hell. That cigarette, bro. You and your friends made a lot of noise out there. It wasn't hard to follow. You live close by? You knew about this place already and organized some effort to get inside. Just passing through. Decided to see what we could scavenge. Uh-huh. And you just got extra lucky. Yeah, we just got lucky, dude. group. Count you plus the two outside, I'm thinking maybe more. You got a camp in these here woods? <laughs> well, sometimes no answer. 
that's as good as anything. Now, I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this stuff. <clears throat> oh, shit. Well, hey there, Squirt. Playing hide and seek, are we? Now that's impolite. Impolite, my ass. You came in here with the guns Don't out first, steal my guy. Us. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. I can kill you, you know. Come on, kid. I'm faster than you. Listen up, Squirt. You're gonna quit pointing that gun at me and let me go my Mary. You understand? I'm just gonna take a little bit, then I'm leaving. Like it never happened. AJ, lower the gun. Clem, he's stealing our food. Alvin Jr., now! Wise woman. Clem, we're running out of time. We need to get out of here. Don't panic. I was just leaving. Thanks for dinner. It just took all our Who shit, Who in the fuck bro? was that? Just take a bag and fill it up. to me Marlon listen to me I am telling you the place was ransacked it's fine we'll deal with it took y'all a while how poor are they that have not patience a Sam Mitch check it out food that's like a yeah, lot of food that's how observing this ever are. Mitch Y'all gotta be quiet, man. Y'all gotta this. be quiet. You Look know at what it. You're our savior, Clem. No, nah, no, nah, we ain't nobody savior. It's a lot. Lewis and Violet helped too. Neither of them ever brought back this much before. Neither have you. Where did you find all this? The old train station. Clem knew where it was. Train station? That's outside the safe zone. We'd have even more. But we ran into the creep that fucked up our rabbit traps. Creep? What creep? Clem saw him smoking those nasty ass Bible cigarettes. He had I'll tell you, weird, man, that Brody chick, eyes. she just seems suspicious, man. She just seems suspicious. I'm telling you, something ain't right. Did he follow you? No, I let him have some food, and then we lost track of him in a swarm of walkers. You just let him take our food? What it wasn't our food from the Now he knows we're out here and he'll come back for more. What the hell were you thinking? This is fucked. How could you be so stupid? If I hadn't done what I did, he would have shot us. I made the right call. Bullshit! What if there are others? You don't know what people oh are gosh. capable of out there. Think again. I, I just can't. I won't. Just... Not again. Fuck! What the hell's what going is wrong on here? With this chick? She took them outside the safe zone. They saw someone. You know what that means! Enough! Just means there's a hungry guy out there looking for food. It's happened before. You are overreacting. Man, she sounds to somebody. You she can't needs some meds. Serious! Bro. Come on, let's go somewhere and talk about this. Oh shit. If anything happens, I'm holding you responsible. Really? Clem. I know I asked you for help. You did. You did. 
but... Shit. God, nothing's easy. No one died. You don't have to worry. I always do, though. Can't help it. <laughs> well, at least we're eating tonight. For the next few, I'd wager. Yeah, um, you're welcome. Go talk to Brody. Thanks for the haul, Clem. You guys should go enjoy say, it. Man, You've earned it. We out there risking our life to help everyone. Don't sweat it, Clem. Ever since we lost Sophie and Minnie, Brody's been freaked out by anything that happens past the safe zone. She'll Why be all right eventually. Just standing over Still, us like we should make sure this is a one-time thing. We can take Rosie out in the morning, see if she catches a scent. You know, just in case. I'm gonna go clean up. I think I'll go too. See you later. Don't worry about them. They're just sad. Sad? Why? My sisters died around this time last year. I think it's starting to get to people. Yeah, that could be the reason. Doesn't it get to you? Not really. Dying's not scary. I mean, it's sad, but not scary. Yeah, I don't know what to say to that. I try not to focus on them being gone. I like picturing where they'd be now, instead. Sophie was hey, awesome to me. That's dope. That's what's She'd up. build a place big enough for all of us to live. And paint it, too. And Minnie be playing whatever new song she wrote. I guess death doesn't scare me, because I know I have something waiting on the other side. Someplace safe and happy. Looks like a nice place to wind up. Yeah. I think so, too. A lot better than some smelly old school. Who are those yeah, guys? The what you got for now. You want them there, too? They weren't always walkers. Wherever this place is, everyone gets to be a person again. Sometimes I draw the walkers the way they probably looked. Sometimes I draw Minnie and Sophie the way they probably left them. But sometimes, I draw this too. Can... can I be there? Sure. That's what's up, you man. Be there Little too? TM man got a big heart, dog. He got a I real big heart. I promise I'll draw you well. Sure, why not? Oh, I almost forgot. Here you he go. He got a big heart, dog. It's yours. It's ours. It's getting late. Yeah, you guys should get some sleep. Aren't you coming? Not yet. I want to finish this first. Good night. See you tomorrow. Well, night falls on us again. But this time, we actually got a good haul of food. We actually all made it back safe. Time for so bed, it was a guy. okay Can night, I, I guess I could say. It was an no. okay night. Two more minutes. Tell you what, you lay down, and then we'll see. You full from dinner? Yeah, it was good. Yeah, it was. I like it here. I got to kill fish. Violet didn't look like she was having fun. But I did. It's nice not driving everywhere or running away. But the ranch was nice too, before the blood. This isn't the ranch. 
Do you like it? I like it. Now that I'm used to it. It's good, for now. But places change, and so do people. It might not stay good. Don't worry, we're not leaving. Clem. Yeah? You let that mean man go at the station. You let him take food from us. It wasn't right. I didn't like it. Don't be mad at me for saying that, though. Him getting away with a little food kept things from getting violent. You have to know when to fight, AJ, and this wasn't the time. It's still not right to let someone take from us. It makes us soft. So you're so tough, huh? Sometimes, bro. <laughs> You just gotta get away Who's from Who's Mr. Fight, Softy bro. now? Sometimes it's not worth the fight. She's right. Well, that's what it's I thought. Not. There. You gotta stay up two minutes more. Time for sleep. I'll lay down when you blow out the light. All right. Give me a minute. There. That's a good drawing. He's a good artist. Your picture is good, too. Oh, I know. There. You have to water flowers. Not these. They're fake. So they never die? Never. Well, lucky flowers. But they're not as pretty. Alright, what else do we have to do? I'm not sleepy. <laughs> Liar. Uh, let's back up real quick. Let's see what else we can do since he's not sleepy at the moment. So used to lugging this everywhere. Never knowing when we'd find any supplies. I feel a lot lighter. Alright, alright. There's nothing else, my guy. Time to go to sleep. Good night, sleep tight, don't let a walker bite. And if they try, I never let them bite. Come on, play it right. One time, bang. <laughs> Good work, and thanks. Well, that was the night, and we have went fishing, We've done some activity. <laughs> like we had to kill walkers. Ran into a stranger. Like, yo. What a night. What's that? There's voices in the pipes. I think someone's in trouble. Is it us? No, no, no. Not right now. But we should help them. If it's a monster, we should kill it. I don't think it is. You got your gun. Uh-huh. I'll be right back. Stay safe. Well, all right, you guys, this is where we're going to call it an end to this video today. Now, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and appreciate the content. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up on that video. And to all of you that are new, hey, subscribe. It doesn't cost a thing to be part of the Ripper Gang. And for all my day ones, Ripper Gang is in the building.
you guys know what you can do for me. Hit that like, share, subscribe button. Make sure your notification bell is turned on. That's the way every time I drop a video, you will be notified. And until next time, Ripper Gang, stay safe out there and take care of each other. And oh yeah, if you didn't see the first, well, part one to episode one, go back and check that out. And you can also go check out my YouTube short video that should be uploaded previously with me and the VOA squad just kicking around some jokes. And also be on the lookout for our new family channel, which is entitled The Ripper Family, which will be coming to brands near you soon. So until next time, you guys, stay safe out there. It's your boy Soul Ripper, signing out. Whatever you want, we do with your body, baby, with no regrets. Ain't no telling what it is.